Hey there everybody, this is Lee with Creative Two Time Mom and we are back to the Homeschool ABC Cool Lab series. This week's letter is the letter Y, Y for yoga. So why, why for yoga? Isn't that a mommy topic? I thought this was a homeschool series. Well, yes and no. I don't know about you, but homeschooling can actually be pretty stressful for me. There are times, just like any other job outside of the home, where I have deadlines, I got things I gotta do, I got things pulling on my attention all the time. I've got things that I gotta do for the charter, I've got papers I gotta grade, lessons I gotta plan, and yes, I only have three kids, but I'm also teaching three different grade levels, and it can be stressful balancing it all. And I think sometimes, because I'm the mom, I see all those character flaws that are coming out as well. And it's hard as a mom to have the same kind of patience because I want so much to raise awesome, awesome kids. Not just great students, but awesome kids. So it can be kind of stressful. So I think for everybody, you gotta find the ways that are gonna help you relax. For me, sometimes it's a cup of tea first thing in the morning, or it's 30 minutes of reading for bed or it's that once or twice yoga class because oh, I don't know about you mamas, but yoga totally puts me in this relaxation state. It's like that time where somebody is telling me exactly what I have to do and I'm not telling three other little duckling children what they have to do. It's just a chance to stretch, to work out, to start to relax and my particular yoga teacher she ends every class with about two or three minutes of just laying on the mat eyes closed concentrate on your breathing clear your mind and it's just this this time of day it's the only two or three minutes in my day where it's just quiet the absolute quiet and she always says okay you know when you're ready we're gonna move on and we're gonna close out class but if you're not ready that's okay too and for me most of the time I'm ready after that hour of yoga but because I'm friends with this teacher there are those occasional weeks where I just lay there for another two three minutes and I pull myself back together that's my time to really de-stress and get ready to come back to my kids with a smile so leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you do to relax as a homeschooler. What do you do to help bring things back into perspective so that you can be a better mom, a better homeschooler, a better wife? What do you do? I want to know how you're relaxing. We'll talk to you later.